Hi everybody, thanks for joining me today. Today I'm going to be doing a love slash Valentine's Day themed manicure. Really easy, we're just going to do a couple of accent nails. Um, because this red stands on its own so nicely. Where this is from? Sally Hansen Insta Dry. That's right. It's called Quick Brick. This is one of the few that um, needs two coats to really be opaque, but it dries very quickly to a beautiful shine. And then on the other two nails, the accents, I'm just using my Milani High Speed Fast Dry White Polish. White on the spot. Okay, and now for the stamping. Um, I am going to be starting with uh, Sally Hansen Insta Dry in Rapid Red. We're going to be using Bundle Monster Plate 314. We're going to be using these swirl lines up here. Um, this is our third series, in case you're wondering. Okay, I'm going to pick that up and then I'm going to take from the side of the nail and roll that over. And I want to leave that gap on the side here. Okay. Um, and so now we're going to move on to a different plate. This one is from Winstonia. It's their first series of plates, plate 102, and we're going to use this little boy and girl kissing right here. I'm going to stamp that using clean color in black, just a plain black. Okay, and I'm going to place those right here on the side of the nail where that gap is or at least close to it, okay? So I've got the two little kissing people. And then we're going to take, I'm just gonna take this little, I have this little package that had a bunch of little cutouts and or little kind of plastic iridescent heart shapes. If you have a rhinestone, you could use one of those too, or even another stamp if you'd like. I'm just going to take some sesh feet or whatever top coat you like to use. I'm going to place a little right above the heads of the two little love birds there. And you're just using a toothpick. I dipped into there so I can pick up this heart. I'm going to place it right here above their heads. Okay, so they're kind of kissing. And then once you have uh, everything the way you like it, you will just go ahead and put a whole layer of sesh feet over the top. So let me top coat these and I'll come back and show you how it looks. Okay, so here it is. It's got that shiny coat and it pulls, it um, evens out the surface too so you don't see too much bump with that little heart shaped glitter. And then here's the thumb. My little people are crooked on that one, but that's okay. Okay, so that's it for this one. Really easy to do. Um, if you are somebody who does like to have stamped images on all of your nails, you could very easily take that um, that swirled pattern here from the Bundle Monster plate and just stamp it like in a white or black or whatever you'd like to do to, if you want to pull them together that way. But I just love this red polish so much, I just want to leave it. Let it shine on its own. <laughs> so that is it for this one. I hope you guys like this. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye.